Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In this video, we are going to take up one very interesting question from algebra. We have to evaluate the expression x power 4 over x power 8 plus 1 if given equation is x power 5 over x power 10 plus 1 equal to 1 over 2525. So let's get started by considering this expression equal to k. So we have to find the value of k finally. Now I will begin with our given equation. See the denominator of this equation is always positive. Right hand side constant it is positive. So this x power 5 should be positive. Conclusion is for real solutions x should be greater than 0. Now I will consider flipping of LHS and RHS. So I can swap numerator denominator x power 10 plus 1 divided by x power 5. So right hand side will be 2525. x is non-zero so I can divide also x power 5 plus 1 over x power 5 equal to 2525. And from our expression if I will flip numerator and denominator take reciprocal so I can write x power 8 plus 1 divided by x power 4 it is equal to 1 over k. After dividing by x power 4 x power 4 plus 1 over x power 4 we have to calculate and equate with 1 over k. Now substitution time. I will consider x equal to let x equal to a. Since x is positive, so a must be positive. 1 over x equal to b. b must also be positive. So if I will take product a times b, then I will be writing x times 1 over x, it will be 1. a b is 1. Now I will write our equations in terms of a and b. So equation will become a power 5 plus b power 5 equal to 2525. And what we are going to find out that is x power 4 plus 1 over x power 4 which will be equal to a power 4 plus b power 4. And then we will write 1 over k. So target is a power 4 plus b power 4 given or known equation will be a b 1 and a power 5 plus b power 5 equal to 2525. Let's solve. I will write a power 5 plus b power 5 equal to 2525. a b equal to 1. And target expression is a power 4 plus b power 4 and we will equate 1 over k and then we will calculate what is k. Now let us assume a plus b equal to u. a is positive, b is positive, so u must be positive. Now I will write binomial expansion for a plus b whole power 5. So for this we should know the coefficients of expansion. So let me write here. For power 2, 1, 2, 1. For power 3, 1, 3, 3, 1. For power 4, 1, 4, 6, 4, 1. And for power 5 which is required here, 1, 5, 10, 10, 5, 1. So let us write this expansion first. So I will be writing here a power 5 plus b power 5 first and last coefficient altogether plus 5 times a power 4 b plus a b power 4 plus 10 times a cube b square plus a square b cube. Now we will use a b equal to 1 and a power 5 plus b power 5 equal to 2525. And we will write LHS as u power 5. 
let's write the values so it will be u power 5 right hand side here we'll be writing 2525 plus 5 times i will take a b common from the bracket so a cube plus b cube and here i will take a square b square common from the bracket so i will be having a plus b left in the bracket now a plus b is u let me put values u power 5 equal to 2525 ab is 1 this value is 1 this value is 1 square again 1 so 5 times a cube plus b cube plus 10 times a plus b which is u now the only point is we have to calculate a cube plus b cube also so let me write here a plus b equal to u first so i will write a plus b if it is u consider cubing both sides so a cube plus b cube plus 3ab a plus b equal to u cube so a cube plus b cube will be let me put values here ab is 1 a plus b is u equal to u cube so i can write from here a cube plus b cube value it will be u cube minus 3 u a cube plus b cube value u cube minus 3 u let's apply this value here so i'll be writing our equation u power 5 equal to 2525 plus 5 times u cube minus 3u plus 10u. Let me write u power 5 equal to 2525 plus 5 times u cube minus 3u and last term which will be 10u. Now I will simplify LHS RHS and take all the terms to one side then we will have finally equation u power 5 minus 5u cube plus 5u minus 2525 equal to 0. Now this is quintic equation degree 5. Now I will use rational root theorem and synthetic division method. So let us find first the eligible factors of this constant written term. So if I will write then it is plus minus 1 plus minus 5 plus minus 25 plus minus 101 plus minus 505 and plus minus 2525. Same job if I will consider for the leading coefficient which is 1, so plus minus 1. Now we have to take the ratio of constant to leading coefficient. So let me plug in u equal to 1. Will it satisfy? 1 minus 5 plus 5 minus 2, 5, 2, 5. No, it will not. If I will plug in u equal to 5, so 5 power 5 minus 5 times 5 q plus 5 times 5 minus 2, 5, 2, 5. So 5 power 5 is 3125 minus 5 cube is 125 times 5, 625 plus 25 minus 2, 5, 2, 5. So if I will calculate then this value is 2500 and here 2500. So yes, it is giving us RHS 0. So that means u equal to 5 is our base solution. Now we will use synthetic division method for finding out the remaining four factors of this quintic equation. Let me write here. Let me write all the coefficients of the quintic equation once with base solution u equal to 5. So coefficients will be 1, 0, minus 5, 0, 5 and negative 2525. 
now we will take leading coefficient 1 as it is. Now 5 times 1, 5, 5. 5 times 5, 25, 20. 5 times 20, 100, 100. 5 times 100, 500, 505. 5 times 505, 2525. 25. Addition will be 0. Now these are coefficients of quartic equation. So let me write u power 4 plus 5u cube plus 20u square plus 100u plus 505. Now there was one condition on u. a plus b was u. So u should be always greater than 0. And just observing this quartic equation, you can see all the coefficients of this equation. It is positive. So the value, the real value of u which will satisfy this, it would be negative. So contradictory condition is there. So we will write non-real solutions we will get from here. So which solution we are going to accept? It is u equal to 5. Let us write u was our substitution a plus b equal to 5. Target is to find out a power 4 plus b power 4 and then we will equate with 1 over k and value of k is our answer. So I will consider squaring a plus b equal to 5. Let's consider squaring whole square whole square a square plus b square plus twice ab right hand side is 25. Now ab is 1. So I can write a square plus b square plus 1 equal to 25. It is 2, 2 times 1. So a square plus b square will be 25 minus 2, 23. Now again we will consider squaring. So a square plus b square equal to 23. Whole square both sides. So I will write a power 4 plus b power 4 plus 2a square b square equal to 23 square. Now I will plug in ab equal to 1. So a power 4 plus b power 4 plus 2 times ab whole square. Let me write once. Equal to 23 square is 529. Now apply AB equal to 1. So I will write A power 4 plus B power 4 plus 2 equal to 529. So A power 4 plus B power 4, it will be 529 minus 2, so 527. Now I will equate this equation equal to 1 over K. Now just calculate the value of k, that would be our answer. So I will write here 1 over k equal to 527. So k will be equal to 1 divided by 527. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care of yourself. Bye bye.